yeah welcome back students uh, first let us go for this yesterday's question yesterday i asked you one question and today i'm going to uh, explain that question in a simple way right that is one thing but before that one just make a note of this question this is the question for you for tomorrow right so you solve this question and tomorrow i'm going to explain this one just make a note of this make a note of this question this question is in this way a contractor engaged five men to complete the work in 20 days after 15 days he had to engage two more men in order to finish the work on time if he had not engaged these additional men how many total days it would have taken to complete the work please make a note of this question and i'm going to give solution for this question tomorrow with the simplest possible way all right now now let us go to this uh, yesterday's question what was the yesterday's question and how to solve this one right i hope most of you might have done this question this question is very simple but you need to understand the uh, given concept in a proper way the first one they have given in this question two ladies simultaneously leave cities a and b connected by a straight road and travel towards each other the first lady travels 2 kilometers faster than the second and reaches b 1 hour before the second lady reaches a this is 1 hour before second lady reaches a then the two cities a and b are 24 kilometers apart how many kilometers an hour each lady does travel is the question now those who have already finished the question you please uh, note down the answer for this one answer is uh, lady 1 the first lady travels at uh, 8 kilometers per hour and obviously second lady travels uh, at 6 kilometers per hour all right the answer is first lady 8 kilometers per hour and second lady 6 kilometers per hour right how to go for this question see friends while going for any mathematics question first make it into two parts one is the information part and other one is question based on the information part or question asked down the information part if you feel that the question cannot be answered with the given information straight away your answer would be data inadequate all right always do in that way because in most of the competitive exams some questions are based on data inadequate option also for that reason you need to divide that one into two anyway for this question there is uh, like no such situation to get data inadequate directly you can get the answer first lady 8 kilometers per hour second is 6 kilometers per hour how to go for this one we can solve this question using mathematics algebra in one step you can solve the question all right here very clearly they have given in this way uh, this is place a and this is place uh, b two ladies started towards each other simultaneously at the same time that is right so now let us imagine that lady 1 is traveling from a to b no need to imagine they have given that one right so lady 1 is traveling from a to b and lady 2 is traveling from b to a this is what they have given all right so now both are like uh, traveling towards each other so this is lady 1 this is lady 2 they have given now again they have given that uh, lady 1 is going 2 kilometers faster than lady 2 that is the reason why lady 1 reaches b 1 hour before lady 2 reaches a this is what exactly they have given all right so now uh, here in this question the point very very important point in this question is time difference between these two right time difference between lady 1 and lady 2 they have given 1 hour i can solve the question using this one right finally the gist for this question the clue for this question is uh, or otherwise i need to solve the question based on this clue they have given in this way time taken by lady 1 time taken by lady 1 is uh, less than that of time taken by lady 2 because lady 1 is moving faster than lady 2 for that reason the difference between these two will be in this way time taken by lady 2 minus time taken by lady 1 they have given as 1 hour this is enough for me to solve the question i am going to solve the question based on this clue right let us start this one i'll go in this way to show this difference in terms of the equation in terms of the equation let us go in this way finally my like uh, 
clue is this one time taken by lady 2 minus time taken by lady 1 is 1 hour this is 1 hour I am going to solve the question in this way let us imagine in this way let us take in this way lady 1 is traveling at x kilometers per hour I am taking this one as x kilometers per hour obviously lady 2 is traveling less than lady 1 speed that is x minus 2 kilometers per hour this is what they have given now I can very simply solve the question the distance is given 24 kilometers here right so 24 kilometers for lady 1 A to B and B to A also that is 24 kilometers both the ladies reach the target but the time difference is 1 hour I am showing in this way for lady 1 time taken by lady 1 right time taken by lady 1 is equal to distance by distance is 24 they have given distance by speed right then time taken by lady 2 is a distance by 24 by x minus 2 hours this is hours and this is hours how to show the difference now time taken by lady 2 is more than that of time taken by lady 1 now my equation is going to be I am writing here simple equation this one the equation is a time taken by lady 2 that is 24 by x minus 2 minus 24 by x is equal to 1 hour is equal to 1 hour right I just repeat this one time taken by lady 2 minus time taken by lady 1 is equal to 1 hour this is 24 by x minus 2 minus 24 by x is equal to 1 enough the question is solved here right you solve this one uh, that will, there will be fractions because 24x 24x will be cancelled right finally you get uh, uh, two values for that one x is equal to because x minus 1 is equal to 0 x plus 6 is equal to 0 after taking factors there so now it will be because it will become 24 into 2 48 the factors are 8 and 6 so that is minus 8 and plus 6 then minus 8 will become the answer I have to take only the positive one so x is equal to 8 do the factor factors here right x is equal to 8 once you get x is equal to 8 x is nothing but uh, time uh, this one uh, speed of lady 1 x kilometer per hour and obviously uh, speed of lady 2 I am writing the final answers here first one x I got x kilometer x is 8 kilometers per hour now simply I can conclude finally uh, speed of lady 1 speed of lady 1 is uh, 8 kilometers per hour then speed of lady 2 is uh, let us uh, go for this one this is 6 kilometers per hour this is what exactly they have asked how many kilometers per hour each lady does travel first lady travels 8 kilometers in 1 hour second lady travels 6 kilometers per hour so in 1 hour she is going to travel 6 kilometers hope you understood this one right so this is how we need to solve a question see in one step we have solved the question there is another method for this one using unitary method also but unitary method is a little lengthier than this one that's the reason why I did not explain you that one simply with one step I can get the answer understood this one right so friends what we are going to do tomorrow again I am going to explain that question that contractor engaged some people again additional men are being engaged if those men are not engaged how much time would it be taking for original persons to do the work is the question so that is from time and work I'll explain you that one tomorrow but uh, before explaining that question probably I'll give a little introduction about time and work then after that I'm going to explain this one right tomorrow if possible I'm going to go for uh, one more question from seating arrangement also one high level question from seating arrangement thank you very much